I'm Dave McLean. I get to be the lead pastor of Abundant Life uh, right here in Bible Hill, Nova Scotia. And, and as I was reading my Bible this morning, um, I was reading about the prodigal son. And I've read this story a bunch of times. I wouldn't so much say that I saw anything new so much as I was reminded of something. As I was reading this story, uh, Jesus says in the prodigal son story, he says this phrase, so he got up. You know, I think that there are a lot of uh, Christians that uh, get to the place where uh, we have this awakening moment. We get brutally honest with ourselves. We recognize that the direction we're going uh, isn't going to bring forth what what we want to see. Uh, We get brutally honest, but we never get around to taking action. We never get around to putting feet to the direction that we need to go. We get stuck between brutally honest and action. Uh, And yet, I, I think that it's so significant that we don't just come to the truth uh, in the sense of we we mentally ascend to it that we're not even just confessing man I've missed the mark and and I in but we gotta get to the place I, I guess I want to say it this way your story must include the same phrase so he got up you know the prodigal son says I will get up and I will go to my father and I will say uh, and I think that it's so important too often we're uh, you know hey pastor I don't feel like doing it I know that probably what you're saying I agree with you but I just don't feel like it and I think too often we get stuck in this place where uh, we're waiting for motivation to somehow hit us but uh, it reminds me of my kids every once in a while I'm like hey listen we're gonna go we're gonna go to Victoria Park. We're gonna go for a walk. I don't want to. I don't feel like it. I don't feel like. <laughs> and it's like, okay, that's cool. Uh, get in the van. <laughs> I'm one of those parents that that's like, okay, I hear what you're saying. Hasn't changed anything, but get in the van. Uh, off we go. And usually it's when we get there, next thing you know, they're having fun, we're hiking, we're taking pictures, we're having a good time. Uh, Maybe I just say this, believers, it's time for you to stop worrying, stop concerning yourself with whether you feel like it or not. Let your feelings catch up to your actions and get up and go do, put action behind what you know to do. Man, I pray this encourages you today. Have an amazing day. Catch you later. Bless you.